It all begins with love, actually, because perfect love casts out all fear. So if we're not loving our neighbor, if we're not loving our fellow man, then it's going to be difficult to experience joy. We can experience happiness, you know, moments, but to have deep abiding joy inside of us. I believe that joy springs from the well of love inside of us. And the cool thing is, you know, Romans 5, 5 says that the love of God is shed abroad in our heart by the Holy Spirit. So we're, we, there's an unfathomable ocean of love inside of us that if we would tap into, the product of that is absolute joy. And when you have joy, joy is so infectious. I mean, people want to be around people who are happy not depressed, you know, not down. And the church has certainly had a presence of gloom and doom over it. If we're right with God, and when I say right with God, if we're in alignment with His will, in public office, wherever we are, that there's going to be an amazing sense of joy. And people are gonna be drawn to us, just they're gonna be drawn to us because they sense that, they, because they themselves are dealing with depression and fear and darkness. And we come along with this, you know, bubbly light if you will, um, and wow, it's so infectious. And like, tell me, you know, where, where do you get your joy? Where why are you so happy? There's so many problems. There's this, 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 this. this. Well, that, let me tell you about that. You know, my joy doesn't stem from the circumstances around me. It stems from the Christ within me. And that, you know, what an effective tool to witness 